Hi YouTube, this is Tara and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so I'm in the break room and okay, y'all know how this light do. One minute this light is on point, the next minute it's not. <laughs> I mean, it's 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 uncanny, really. Um, but this is how we're gonna do. So I was gonna make this like a mystery product. Oh, look, I have a banana nut muffin for breakfast. And look what I brought. I couldn't find my other toothbrush. I know it don't fell down in my drawer somewhere, but if you see banana nut muffin or something in my teeth, please excuse me. But do what I got. And so, if you've never heard of this brand, Plan and Makeup by Yolando. She's on Facebook real heavy. She's not, and she's on TikTok. She's on Instagram, but she's not quite on YouTube. Unless somebody like myself or somebody else um, mentioned her. So on my face, you know, I clean my face and wash my face this morning before I left. And you all know I normally put my brows on. Not normally, but for the past couple of weeks, I've been putting my brows on. So when I ordered from uh, Auntie Pat, she had gave me this sample size essence i don't know what an essence is or what it do what it for but i don't know so i just shook it up real good put it on my face then i put my vitamin c on my face okay and then i put my laura mercier um mattifying um mattifying um Oh, I'm trying to stand this up. My my Laura Mercier mattifying moisturizer. Okay, so this is called Brow Sculpting Soap. I have no reason to use this. Well, I I I, I don't, but because I don't have brows to sculpt. So let me show you what it is. It comes with this. And it comes with this little spoolie thing, okay? So I guess you can straighten it out as well. I guess it just comes like that in the box, maybe. Let me pull y'all. Not that y'all haven't seen my brows before, but let me pull you in close so you can see my brows, if you can see them, with no product. Okay. I, ver I have none. Really, they're real thin, real fine. And when I go to the young lady that does them, what she do, she just kind of clean them up with a razor. And then you can start to see them. Okay. So, if you have more brows than this, this may be the product for you. Okay. So, it looks like Vaseline or something in here. Wax. That's what it looks like. Wax. It's in here. You just can't see it. Well, this looks more silver stainless steel and this got kind of like a yellowish tint to it that's the product so you're supposed to spray this with water okay and i have a cup of water right here with some paper napkins in it so i'm just gonna wet it like that and this is not how everybody else uses it it says right here, dip your brush into the brow soap lightly and coat the bristles with product. Brush through the brows on upwards and create a drained look. Spray with water onto the brush, not on the soap. Don't wet this part, wet this. Now what the instruction says, I can use this by itself. I can go ahead and scope my brows by itself without no product on it. Okay, I can go ahead and fill my brows in. Which is saying like I left my... Can I leave, leave my... This is the pencil I've been using before I leave home. I can go ahead and fill my brow in with this and then do that on top. So... So 
So this is wet. So let's see what it's gonna do. It said rub it. Yeah, it says spray with water onto the brush. I think I might need a little bit more water. Okay, and then dip it in here. How you dip it in here? It says dip your brush into the brow soap lightly and coat the bristles with product. Lightly. Mm, I guess I'm doing too much. Okay, so it's on there. <laughs> I guess I did too much, y'all, because it said lightly. Okay, so, y'all know what? I'm going to have to take my glasses off so I can kind of see. So I can see these brows, these brow hairs. And which way they going. It's almost like, like, like gel or mousse. You see what I'm saying? It's almost like. Like hair gel. Or mousse or something. Okay. And I, then I see some people do this. I don't really feel the product on. But then. I'm going to take this pencil. Yeah. Excuse me. Mm. So we're gonna go ahead and fill this one in with our pencil. This is the pencil I've been using. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to take this, we're going to wet it a little bit. We're going to dip it in here lightly. <laughs> Y'all know I can't see. And then we're going to take the brow soap. And then we got a brow scope. And then we're going to do the inside there. Ooh. Let's see. And we're going to do that. And then. Let's see. Okay. So now we got that together.
then we're gonna fill it back in some more. Okay, so let's get over here. I really can't see. I'm gonna call, um, now I do see where it kind of got my brows over here. It's like edge control. That's what I was trying to say. Mm-hmm. It's like edge control. And I kind of like it. Mm -hmm. Y'all yeah, be trying not to sing. And stuff while I'm doing my brows. And talk. Because I can just be thinking about anything. So, you got an arch right there on the other side. But not so much on this side. And then we're going to come down with that arch. And y'all know this light is so funny with me. And then I can't really see. So, I'm going to have to clean that up. Okay, so this is what the brow soap is looking like. After I then rubbed it. Okay, so um hold on. Okay, so you know we got our juvenile place. And so we just gonna put a little bit on the back of our hand. And you have to shake the juvenile place up. And the reason why you have to shake the Juvia's place up is because the Juvia's place is, it'll be liquidy, it'll be kind of like water. Okay, now I like the shape of this one. This one is a little high up here. So, let's see, can we... Now, I think I messed up. What I should have did was put my glasses on while I do this one. Because... I'm using this eye to see. This eye can't see nothing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
So let's clean it up. I got a dip. Mm-mm. Something still a little off with this one. Okay. I don't know if it's off at the top or the bottom, but I'm going to come in at the bottom here. And y'all see my hairs right there? I got to try to hide my hairs with the concealer. I'm sorry, y'all, because I'm using my phone to do this. And that's hardly nobody here today. And I think school start for a lot of people. So they're making sure they get their kids off. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Nope. So let's get at the top. Yeah, I think a lot of kids are at school. It's their first day. Their parents are. <sighs> Y'all, sometimes I have this little issue going on with my fingers. It's like. And see, I made that one thinner, and this one is still thicker. But well, we're not going to really trip, because y'all know I can't really see. Uh, it's the light, too, with it then. But we're going we gonna to leave it like this. It's a little bit too different. And I'm not using foundation today. Y'all, I mean, my fingers are literally getting stuck. Mm. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Let me see. Okay, so that's it. You know, with the brow soap. And y'all tell me which one you like. 
So with this one right here, I did the brow soap first, brow scope first, and then filled it in. As you can see, I need to I need to go get my brows done. And with this one, I filled it in first, and then put the brow scope on top of it. Okay, and then of course, y'all know I use my shade three in Julia's place to clean up but i forgot to do the rest of the lid to give an appearance that i have on shadow and so let me hurry up and do that so i can go on back to my desk i was going to put on some eyeshadow for you guys um and it was going to be julia's place but <laughs> still working within the tribe palette mm Okay, and I do have these two. And the brown in here. This shade right here is probably not going to show up pretty good. So, I'm trying to figure out which shade I'm going to use because I've used in this Julia Place palette. Let me see how much. Okay. So, in this Julia Place Tri palette, I use this orange. I use this green right here. And then I use this blue. And then I use this um, chain gut. I also use this. I believe. So the only other thing that I can use to go along with these two colors is to use another green or use an orange. Okay, but I want to use an orange base. And I might use both of them. Okay. I might use the orange and the green.
-hmm. Okay, now I won't use the green. So what I'll do is I'll take let's see can we take off. Let's take this pen. This let's take this brush. Dip it in some water. Okay. And I swatched these and I wasn't impressed with the ill maquillage. This is in shade Gwen. So I'm just gonna rub her on here wet with the brush. And we're gonna do this. We're gonna tap her on right here. Gwen. I'm just gonna tap her on. Right here, you see, and then we're gonna put some more, and we're gonna tap her on right here. Now, of course, I can see, but not see. Okay, and on the other side, let's hurry up so we can get back to our seat, do our job, tap, tap in the water a little bit, and we can go in with Amy. So I think I went over a little too far on that green with Amy, but it's okay. And we gonna leave it like that. We're gonna already put our other brush back in the pack. So we're just gonna take our concealer brush and do this. Okay. Now usually this eye is the one that is messy or gets messed up. Um, this one does two at a time. Okay, so with the L maquillage, I can see more, I can see more green over here. I mean, on this eye than this one. But we're not gonna keep messing with it. We just gonna let that be. Okay. Uh oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> we're not gonna go back into, although I want to. So, and for our lips, I don't know if we're gonna do anything for our lips, but which I shouldn't. Sorry about that. I shouldn't do anything for the lips because we're gonna put our mask back on. <laughs> okay, so we did go back in some of that green okay to bring that green back y'all see it it's pretty it's pretty it's just that it got messed up up here 
kind of smoke it out a little bit. And this one is nice and neat, but this is not what people normally want to see. They don't want to see no harsh lines. They want to see it buffed out. So they say in the makeup world. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and take our color pop. I like this color. I can use this by itself. And again, the name of the number has rubbed off. So, we're going to get our busy yard. And I don't know. Um, this is the name of it. B-E-I-G-N-E-T. Okay, playing up with playing that makeup by Yonado Brow Scope. I use these pump, uh, brushes along with the other brush that y'all saw. That was a nail art brush from Manology. That's what that was. The clear looking one. That was a nail art brush. So, don't forget to write, comment, subscribe, thumbs up my video, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend about my channel. I love you for watching till the end. Bye.